right, thanks, Brad. Now, the pictures from the ground are starting to pour in. Ag Day's Betsy Jibben has been talking with producers in the impacted areas. She joins us from the newsroom. Clinton, for some South Dakota ranchers, this is the second blizzard they've experienced in less than a month, and it has terrible timing arriving during calving season. Just snow and freezing rain for now. The calm before the storm. That's the voice of Marty Williams, a rancher in Wall, South Dakota. You can hear how the ground is just a sheet of ice from the freezing rain, with ranchers like Williams worried they will lose power. The same goes for more producers waiting on the worst of the storm today. And now it's turning to snow. They're saying between 8 and 24 inches. I don't know how many we'll get, but I got them in the best place I got. This is just some of what South Dakota and adjacent states saw Wednesday. Some areas expecting over a foot of snow today. Areas in the north and northeast not only blanketed, but buried with wet, heavy snow. But there is more coming. But we uh, have them close to the barn so we can take them in and, and get the calves, have them calve in the barn and nice and warm. Some ranchers and cow-calf producers I'm talking with are bracing for losing power due to some of that thick, heavy ice and they're also waiting for more snow to fall. 